How's it going guys? I want to make a quick video of this Vivarium build that I just finished. Um, real quick, the the tank is a 3 foot tall by 2 foot wide by 2 foot deep tank acrylic. Uh, I built it all, everything built by hand, custom cabinet. Uh, very easy to pull out and pull it out, do maintenance uh, with the aluminum stand. Uh, the tank itself, like I said, uh, built it. It originally was a aquarium for a saltwater fish, but I have plenty of saltwater tanks. Uh, I didn't want no more fish. Here's one, here's my big one, 150 gallon. So I wanted something different. So I went ahead and built this. I did the back out of uh, that great stuff foam. Uh, pretty much I just foamed it up, let it dry, then go ahead and put some clear and black uh, caulking silicone and then use the, I believe it's called corn husk, I mean uh, cocoa husk under the coconut fibers and just smeared it all on top of the uh, caulking until it was dry. I did about three layers to get it nice and nice and even. Uh, the plants right here are these plants right here, you just trim a piece and Stick it on and it'll start growing. You can actually see a little sprout right there. Uh, these, uh, pretty much what I did was when I made the foam, I just cut a hole and then stuck the little pot inside there and now they're starting to grow. Uh, this right here is, it's called the uh, frog moss. It's green when it comes out of the box. I don't know if it's supposed to turn back to green. I'm not sure, but hey. Whatever. This I got a little little driftwood stump and some more plants over here. Everything's doing pretty good. Got a little waterfall and some slate stones that I put into the into the wall. So it's not too bad. And then I have a little small, small I guess lagoon or whatever you want to call it. With uh, there's a little fish in there somewhere. Uh, I'm not sure where he's at, but he's in there. Uh, as far as the frog, I have a, right now he's sleeping, but it's a red-eyed green tree frog. Just got him yesterday. Very nice. Very, very nice. Uh, this is my first attempt at having a vivarium or any type of amphibian. Um, here I have the thermometer and the one that measures humidity um, so uh, that's pretty much it as far as the waterfall back here is the piping the the plumbing that goes straight down and uh, since this was a a reef tank I had a sump which this sump is an overkill all I have right now is a, a filter sock that kind of filters anything out and then the little pump right there, the small heater. This side, it's empty, there's nothing there. Uh, not sure what I wanna do. Maybe I'll have some crickets there, I'm not sure. But um, in the back, I have a humidifier. It's not on right now, but if I wanna turn it on, I just gotta pull this out a little bit. Move this plant. Go ahead and turn this on. I'll put it on high and you'll see the humidifier right there coming out there's a little hole right there that I cut out so I'm gonna put this humidifier on a timer so that it'll cut on and off because if I leave it on it just fills up the whole thing is even if I leave it on I mean if I put out very the lowest it still fills it all up. So I'm gonna find a time or something so it can cut on and off. And as far as for lighting, this is a, just a LED fixture. Uh, three blues, or sorry, four blues and what, eight whites. Uh, and then I, I put a little strip right there just so at night I can kind of see, you can see the frog. And then I have a UVB bulb 
the thing about 25 watt. So other than that, I think it's a pretty cool build. Very pleased with it. Uh, so yeah, hope you guys enjoy. Let me know if you have any questions.